So now that my piano has power, can you hear that okay? Yes, I can. Lovely. So part of my technology, uh, as you see, um, I'll be able to share my screen with you so you can turn wow. around. Wow, um, that's pretty and, like seamless. Yeah, thank you. Um, so we'll be able to kind of let you see what it is that I'm seeing when it's appropriate. Um, I've also got this overhead here. Um, so whatever uh, we need to do um, in terms of seeing what it is that I'm talking about, um, all of that should be pretty seamless. Um, yeah. That's pretty cool. It's like you have like multiple cameras. In yeah, absolutely. I, I've awesome. really ever had a teacher that's gone into this much detail with me about like what my goals are and stuff, but I find it really cool that you do. Um, well, great. Um, and yeah, so again, this, I've had students and, um, you know, for five, six, seven years, um, from when they were just starting out, like all the way into college. Um, so it, it helps me help you, um, if I can know what your interests and goals are a little bit better. Yeah. I mean, I would love to every week to play one song that maybe I pick and then maybe one song that you pick. Sure. Um, and just the, the thing, it was just kind of for these past few years, just playing the same books every single like week. It was just like getting to be a little redundant. So yeah. just, just having a little bit more like freedom, like maybe just kind of what I said, just the, 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 um, one song that I pick and like one song that you'd pick or whatever that kind of works out to me. Yeah, totally understand. Um, all right, well, let's, let's play a little, shall we? Yeah. Um, so the this next part can be a little bit more interactive um, okay. without even looking at music. So the there's a really kind of neat mathematical secret to how these scales work. So from C to F were how many notes? Four. And by the way, this is uh, thinking about ear training as well. Do you recognize that? If we wanted to get that same oh. sound, we would need to add the E flat. What note of the scale is that? Four? It's always the fourth note. That's pretty cool. So the key of B flat major has two flats, the one we started on, the root, B flat, but then also the added flat is always the fourth note. Um, but as you go through the scales, if you can count to four, you can figure out what the scale is. So the flat you just added, E flat, is the next scale. So in the key of E flat, if you go up four notes, instead of A natural, we need to make that A flat. A flat. Uh, another fun trick, that was new, getting up to A flat, but look at what happens at the top of the scale. It's the exact same thing we just learned for B flat. Interesting. The top of the scale is the scale you just learned. Yes, it's it's very uh, it, it fascinates me. It's an endless web of mathematical relationships, and you don't have to think about the math. It's just the fact that the math is in there. All of these patterns end up emerging. So using that little formula, um, the key of C has no flats. You go up four notes. Key of F has one flat. You go up four notes. And then A. Through it once. And again, I'm counting the ride symbol, keeping track of that. Um, eight measure phrase. Your turn. Excellent, you got it. Yeah. So, so that triplet rhythm on beat four is our walk the dog. So it goes like walk this. The dog. 
One, two, three, and on beat four, walk the dog. One, two, three, walk the dog. Nice. Now try it. Probably hundreds of blues songs that have different variations of chords and the orders of chords, but there's a what's called a basic 12 bar blues progression. Mm -hmm. Bars meaning measures. Mm -hmm. um, and if we were super basic, I would just say, just play a down strum for each beat. So in a 12 bar blues, we can divide it into three lines. Each line has four measures and each of these letters represents one measure. So in line one of a 12 bar blues, I'm gonna play four measures of four beats of E. Yeah. So we could count it out thinking one, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, three, two, three, four, four, two, three, four. Or if we wanted to be a little more creative, uh, we could add the riff on top of that. Two, three, four, three, two, three, four, four, two, three, four. And then that takes us to the next line, which is two bars of A, back to two bars of E.